Hi ladies and gentlemen, I'm Ivan Zujek from Webwash and today we'll look at the TOC filter module. If you want to learn more about Drupal, check out our website at webwash.net or follow us on Twitter at webwashnet. The TOC filter automatically creates a table of contents listing using header tags. Also, you can define where the table of contents listing will appear by placing a TOC token within your content. Trust me, this will all make sense once you see the module in action. So let's go over to our test site and enable the module. Let's go to modules, search for TOC, and click on save. Now let's go over to configuration and text formats. And let's, and let's set up the filter on the filtered HTML text format. Click on configure and let's enable the table of contents. Make sure it's last and we'll need to allow the H3 tag and then click on save configuration. Let's go ahead and create a piece of content. So go to add content and I'll call this article test article and I'll paste in some content which has just paragraphs split between H3s. All right, and click on save. And here you can see our, our table of content was automatically generated from our H3 tags. Let's now edit our test content. And here you can see this C variable, this is the guts of the module. From here, we can change the title. So let's just call this title. And we can also change the listing from an OL, so an unordered, so sorry, an ordered list to an unordered list. And so you have a different title, and now you have an unordered list. Finally, let's go check out the configuration page for the TOC module. Go to configuration and then just click on TOC filter. And here you can uh, configure a few things. First, you can configure which, which header tag the module will search for. And by default, it's set to H3. And then you can also define default, default titles. So let's just Let's just set the unordered list to unordered, unordered list title and hit save configuration. Now if we go back, and we just remove the title and hit save, and there you go. Now we have a default title. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. And if you have any questions, please leave a comment.